it is authentic. That is one of the, the things that, uh, that attracted me the most to the film. Uh, the fact that we were going to really push the limit and, and, and pay tribute to the beauty and to the spirit of the first one. Because, I mean, it is, it is not a quote-unquote remake. I mean, it's a reimagination and a, and a tribute to the first one. So we needed to really take it to another level. And I think that we accomplished that. And I think, well, from, uh, you know, that uh, it's a great tribute. Those guys are yeah. awesome, no? Yeah, they're so amazing. Yeah. It's a great tribute to, to uh, extreme sports, to people with a passion who are yeah. there and they're willing to risk their lives for the love of sport? Or? Yeah, but the, the, the thing is that, listen, what, what I've learned and what i discovered working with these guys, with this very small handful of people who are capable of doing these things, and, and all of them were working with us on the film, and that's their endorsement that we got. Um, they are so aware of the limited time that we have on this planet that they're willing to defy, to defy death so that they can celebrate life. And that is a beautiful, amazing um, contradiction that we like got to work. Yeah, of course and, it is. Uh, tell me about Bodhi with, uh, you know, yeah. the character. Well, Bodhi, Bo Bodhi's a, uh, Bodhi's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a searcher. He's a searcher and he's a, and he's a soldier in this film. I mean, in this reimagination, more than a spiritual guy, he's more of a, of a, of a, of a eco warrior or an eco-warrior of a soldier. I mean, there's a more militant attitude than a philosophical or a spiritual attitude. But definitely, the adrenaline and the rush serves as a vector to, to, to try to defend the very thing that gives them life. And I leave that very cryptic because I want people to go and to come and watch the movie and discover what that means.